What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here and today I just wanted to go over uh, ideal bitrate settings for streaming on YouTube Live. So on Twitch I believe the maximum bitrate you can have is 6,000 to 7,000 kilobits per second but if you have a fast enough connection on YouTube you can actually get much much higher than that. So we're going to take a look at what bit rates you should aim for for a quality stream if your internet supports it and um, at what resolutions you'll be running it at. So let's scroll down a bit and take a look at these different settings you might be running. So we're not even gonna deal with um, the last three here, 480p, 360, and 240, because no one's streaming at that nowadays, let's be realistic. Um, let's take a look at 720p at 30 frames a second, and we can expect 1,500 to 4,000 kilobits per second as the ideal um, bitrate range, the higher uh, the bit rate the better so you want to stay on the high end of this range for a quality stream if you're doing 60 frames a second you want to raise that to 2250 to 6000 kilobits per second or 6 megabits per second um, this is the max on twitch um, even though they have this setting for 1080p at 60 frames a second so youtube is going to be slightly higher quality on 1080p we're going to be running 3,000 to 6,000 kilobits per second, still within Twitch's range. And then for 1080p 60 frames a second, it's um, between 4,500 and 9,000 kilobits per second. So um, Twitch being at 6 to 7,000 is right in between this. So it's a fair quality for that. But the higher you can get, maybe 9 or even 10,000 kilobits per second, 10 megs a second, if you have that upload speed definitely give that a shot. I'm actually running um, 1080p 60 frames per second at 50 megabits per second, which is way, or 50,000 kilobits per second, which is way higher than it needs to be. But because my internet can handle it and my computer doesn't really get much slower running at that speed, I prefer to do it like that so I can save the archive of it and it'll look almost indistinguishable from the original recording. So I can edit that later. Uh, taking a look at the 1440p settings, we're looking at 6,000 to 13,000 kilobits per second. For 60 frames a second, we're at 9,000 to 18,000 kilobits per second, so about 18 megabits per second. At 4K 2160p, 30 frames a second, we're between 13,000 and 34,000 kilobits per second. And then on the highest range, we have our 4K at 60 frames a second, which props to you if you can stream gameplay at 4K at 60 frames a second. That's pretty tight. Uh, between 20,000 and 51,000 kilobits per second. So 51 megabits per second is totally possible on YouTube. And um, that's pretty awesome. You can get up to some really, really high quality, almost indistinguishable 60 frames per second gameplay while streaming, which is fairly impossible on Twitch without having visual defects that are, I believe, apparent enough to know it's not like actual gameplay. It's, it's being streamed. Even the recordings of it look fairly streamed. So this will let you have more realistic and high quality uh, streaming by just going up to the higher ends of these. And then you could do variable bitrate. Um, I mean, that's a safe way to do it. It'll just uh, tax your computer and try and see where a safe spot for it to run is. But I like having a more consistent number, so I actually set mine at 1080p 60 frames a second. Um, and I'm probably going to be between 30 and 50 megabits per second just because the internet supports it. But yeah, uh, these are the recommended um, bit rates for YouTube. Uh, we can even just for fun take a look at 480p and all that. Uh, 480p is between 500 and 2000 kilobits per second. 360p is 400 to 1000 and 240p is 300 to 700 kilobits per second. So if you're streaming on your phone, maybe some of these might be options, but realistically you're gonna wanna stay at least at 720p, 720p 60. Uh, that's about it. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I will link this article in the comment section below in case you want to check it out yourself or in case you want to see if it's updated. Um, have a great day. Peace.